Right, well, it looks like it's good news for people like me who couldn't get hold of an NES Classic last year. And no, that's not because Nintendo have relented and decided to make more of them. That would be frankly too much to ask. It is Nintendo after all, and uh, yeah, it's just not going to happen, is it? No, what it actually means is that people working in the homebrew scene and who are trying to reverse engineer the Switch, naughty people, we don't want anything to do with them, have been looking at the internals of the Switch and they've actually discovered that there is an NES emulator embedded in the Switch. And this information comes from somewhere called Switch Brew Wiki, which according to Kotaku, is a site dedicated to homebrew software for Nintendo's hybrid console. And what does this mean? Well, it could mean any number of things. It could mean that there's something on the Switch that is going to sit there and do nothing. But it could mean that Nintendo have intended all along to bring NES games to the Switch. And, you know, that's not a surprise, is it? Let's be honest. We all know that the virtual console is going to come along eventually. And maybe we'll see some NES games coming on this new service that they've made available or will be making available in the new year. The service that allows you to have certain games with your subscription to the Nintendo Switch online service. And, you know, we've yet to find out more about that, but this could be part of that. Although, as I said in an earlier video, I do think that that's something that Nintendo have brought online after the fact, so to speak. I do think this emulator was probably built in for the Virtual Console, and whether it has anything to do with the games that are made available via this online service is definitely open to question. What we can be pretty certain of is that Nintendo aren't going to change their spots anytime soon. So what do I mean by that? Well, what I mean by that is that there's a good chance that we're going to be seeing Nintendo trying to flog us NES games again. So this emulator will probably just be there to, I suppose, reduce the footprint of the games, perhaps, so they don't have to carry any software to, to help them run. I really don't know. I'm, I'm not a technical guy. I haven't been involved in any of this. This is just stuff that I've been reading. And it is interesting, but as I say, I, I don't really think that it's going to make a great deal of difference. The fact that this is embedded in the, the Switch is an interesting piece of information, but it's not going to change anything in relation to the way Nintendo market their products. As I say, it might help them speed up delivery of NES games. It might make NES games run better, perhaps. I don't know but it's not going to make much difference to the end user in terms of how much it's going to cost. Nintendo will decide how much it's going to cost and us mugs will pay it at the end of the day because that's Nintendo. But it is interesting and if you want to read more about it, you can go to Kotaku and I'll put a link into that. And they also have a, a link to Switch Brew Wiki and I'll put a direct link into that as well. So yeah, um, what else do I need to say? Well. There's one other little thing that's interesting about this, and that's the name of this emulator. And for some weird reason, it's called Flog. <laughs> Switch and Flog? Are there some BDSM people working at Nintendo by some strange chance? Because it's a <laughs> pretty odd set of names, Switch and Flog. You're going to get flogged by the Switch, are we? Or are they going to flog us a Switch? Or are they going to flog us Nintendo NES games on the Switch? Oh, I don't know. Anyway, basically, the name Flog <laughs> makes me think of uh, flogging a dead horse. But, you know, it is what it is. Anyway, uh, what do you guys think? Are you interested in this? Are you interested in NES games? Are you going to sell your NES Classic or stop looking for one? <laughs> or, you know, are you going to... Not hold your breath waiting for Nintendo to deliver a full set of NES games on the Switch. I certainly am not going to hold my breath. But it, as I say, is interesting. Let me know what you think about it in the comments. And in the meantime, I'm going to bugger off and pick up my little boy. And I'll speak to you in the next one. Bye.